All right, ladies, gentlemen, citizens of the Empire, welcome back to Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Let's uh, let's go find that other uh, order member and sniff out the vault. Oh God! <laughs> All right, so let's uh, equip the quest for the firebrand. Nope, that's Raven's Thorpe stuff. All right, so. Alden believes it might be the Red Hand's next target is the Archive. Okay. Well, let's uh, let's go check out the Archive and see what's up. So that'll get us to put the bow away for Christ's sake. is just up here. I, I kind of want to mount uh, Hati, but I know it's probably not going to go any faster than me running. Right, so it's, oh, it's this old church. Enemies here. The archives. This must be where Arthur shuffles the council papers. Not here. Hmm. I should look around. Reeds, timber, food, wine. An expensive list of items to procure for a feast. Yeah, everybody loves Yule. What's that? Weapons shield? and supplies. Not enough to arm and feed even the smallest army. Small mercenary team, maybe? A pile of official scrolls stamped with a seal. That. Thank you, Auden. I will leave with these at once. Of course. A4, isn't it? What brings you to our archives? I've come to ask about these Christian texts. Luvina tells me the Red Hand is stealing them. Mm, and destroying them? I fear they will attack these archives next. The Abbess here has offered to bring the texts somewhere safe. She's been working diligently on this matter. You flatter me, Lord. I only wish to help. Abbess Ingeborg, this is Eivor, our honored guest from the south. Eivor has offered to help rid Jorvik of the Red Hand. How can I help? An abbess does not strike me as a suitable choice against a gang of ruthless bandits. It is my duty to protect the role of Christianity in our lives. Texts like this Gospel of Matthew were created for more than just perusing. They are a gift. They spread the word of God, and it is that which must be preserved, whatsoever the cost. I admire your resolve, but unless the Red Hand is dismantled, they'll continue to harm those in possession of these texts. The Red Hand seems to know where to look for these texts. It may be someone is guiding them. What can you tell me? You know something else that much is clear. The abbess has her suspicions. As much as it pains me to say, I suspect something foul at the rectory. I have heard whispering, collusion, and the bishop. He has been sneaking around the rectory, often visiting the priests in the cover of night. Time I pay these men of faith a visit. All right, the let's take a look around. On the road to the minster. I should look for the bishop there. Is there an artifact in here? Wait. Oh wow, it's up. Where? Up here? I can't. I, I can pull myself up on that. Where is it? Huh. 
Let's see. Let's talk to him. See what he has. I to have say. the Yuletide feast to prepare for us. Okay, well, never mind. Do drop by for the festivities, A4. Interesting. Let's see if we can get up there. Over. Here we go. Right, so, is there a way in from the top? No, there isn't. Maybe over here? First, let's hop up. There's gotta be a way inside. another way inside other than just like get luck because I didn't see any open windows or anything and we'll figure it out later let's go uh let's go check out that rectory let's see, where is it exactly up that way okay cross the bridge again that giant tower? Now that's probably the sink the sink point. Um <laughs> convenient zip line is convenient. Explore. Here is the rectory. The abbess said she suspected secrecy among the priests and bishop. Seems quiet. Where is everyone? <gasps> this is kind of strange. If it's this <gasps> quiet. Mm. Uh oh. I don't know how that caught on fire. There we go. Let's check in. in oh, Hello. Get away! Stop! Enough! Uh, leave me be, please! What is you doused in sweat and trembling so? The, the Red Hand. They're everywhere. Please, I don't want any trouble. Looks as though everyone else has fled this place. So why are you still here? Waiting for the bishop. One of our brothers said he would return soon. That's all I know, I swear it! Where is this other priest? He's locked himself in. That house, just there. All right, let's uh, see if we can interrogate him. So he's in here? Yes, that has to be it. Let's try to find a way inside. Looks like we're gonna be going up. No luck here. Ah! And it's marked with a yellow X for some reason. Someone is hiding in there. Doubt he'll come out. I'll have to find a way in. Greetings! Musky! Been here long, priest? Just who do you think you are, trespassing like this? This is my property you've destroyed. I'm looking for the bishop. Where is he? Gone to his quarters. Said he would return once he finished tending to a private matter. But that was some time ago. Show me there. What do you mean to do with him? Now. Lord, forgive me. I knew I should have left with the others. And I'm getting vibes that the bishop is the front, the uh, firebrand. The bishop's quarters. 
What is that burning smell? Yup, yup. <laughs> there we go. Oil. Burnt stuff. Several Christian texts. The abbess was right to cast suspicion the bishop's way. What is this? Cross? Blood. There was a struggle here. And a corpse. Charred letter beneath the body. He must have tried to hide it before he died. Ugh, the stench. He looks like suture shit. All right, fellow brothers of the light, it is with heavy heart that I will re be resigning from my duties at the ministry, or at the minster. Minster. Uh, the texts we have kept there have been compromised, or yeah, and I can no longer tolerate the abbess's methods. God forgive me, desecrating these sacred texts, my brothers. Listen carefully. The church is no longer safe. Holy grounds. Uh, as I write this letter, I fear that there may be an attempt on my life. Remember this name, the firebrand. She is up. Okay. Someone knew the bishop was conflicted and killed him before he could say a word. It's a confession. The bishop played a part in destroying these texts against his own will. The rest of the letter is burned, but makes mention of the minster and the abbess. Is that where she's been keeping these texts? Look around! Search every room! They're around here somewhere! It's them! It's the Red Hand! Oh, Lord of mercy! Quiet. The red hand. I need to leave. We will burn that sinner just like the others. Is there a way out through the roof? Can't get from there. Hey! Oh, Jesus! Black bag. Time to move. Infiltrate. Okay. Might actually have to fight after all. The target sent the red hand after me. I must be closing in. Some time I head to the minster. The abbess knows more than she's letting on. Firebrand's plan is coming to fruition. At long last. We have waited in the shadows for too long. Is he alone? Keep your eyes there? sharp and watch out for running back. Is there trouble? Come here. Come here. It's okay. No, no problema. Andiamo. Night night. Good way to find up oh, right here. What? Just what do you think you're doing? This is no place for you, priest. Go now. Blasphemy! Stop this at once. Something troubling you, Father? Abbess, look, they are burning all of these passages. Why are you not stopping this? Because I ordered them to. 
What? The vellum that burned before you are covered in lies. So long as they exist, you cannot hope to see the world the way it truly is. Lies? Abbas, what has happened to you? We are God's children all. Do not renounce him like this. Please, I beg of you. You can still repent. God will forgive you. You know he will. Your mind has been poisoned, but worry not. We have the antidote. We will set a new example to which all may aspire. You... you... you're mad! You won't get away with this! I won't let you! There's no one to tell. No one who will hear your cries. If you cannot bear to watch them burn, then you should burn with them. I want it all destroyed! Every text, every passage, every scribbled piece of paper, everything. It is time to end this. Yes, by a brand. The Abyss is the firebrand. She'll kill whoever stands in her way. Time I get between her and her next victim. Okay, so, um, actually I should probably just go out on the roof. So, do I just kill all three of them? Because I can't really tell the immediate difference. <laughs> Honestly, all three of them are in into it, so I might as well just... You know, do us all a favor and execute all of them. Where'd they go? I've lost track of them. Wait, what? Oh, shit. Oh, they're just kind of all around. Okay. Go, Sunan. Let's see, where, um... Right there. Huh. Okay. So we'll just circle around. Restricted air. No, I'm not actually. Oh my god. <laughs> Excuse me, sorry. Need to get up. But why must we burn them? The fire cleanses impurities, and it's our duty to purify the future of Jorvik. Man, Not the, fire. the firebrand. All right, time to keep moving then. <laughs> so the next one, or the only <laughs> other one, is 106 meters away. Show me what lies ahead.
text is destroyed, it will mark the beginning of a new chapter. Just as a... Still not the firebrand. Jesus but I Christ. have you now. Right. At least we know where, where she is. Let's just kind of go up if we can. We're not on the wall, so that's good. Let's see, where exactly is this last one? She's back over towards there. We'll circle around to get out of the uh, restricted area here. Oh, there's a fighting match somewhere nearby. Up we go. Aid me in my eyes. Wait, where is she? Ah. Should be somewhere around there. This doesn't work. And last but not least... Can I... Nope, nope, don't want to carry anyone. Okay, I might have to just to get him out the way. This fire that burns inside. I've always had it. A longing to do something grand and important. But that door was always shut to me. My methods deemed too severe. I was cast out. Shunned. Scorned. But the Order, they took notice of me. Saw that it was courage that drove me. Courage to change the world for the better. They reopened that door. And you used your chance to destroy a way of life you did not support. We have seen time and time again what happens when people are left to interpret for themselves. Knowledge must be controlled. Only then can the message be widely understood. The day where there is but one truth draws nearer. One truth, that is what the Order offers. This one sought to spark a new flame. But did so with a heavy hand, not a teacher's tongue. This cleansing of yours ends here. My work is incomplete, but not inconsequential. There are others who carry on, for one of the four is us. 
Why did you say that? What does it mean? Now I go. A flame that grows bright and burns ever more, ever light. To Helheim, where colder and crueler fires await. Let's get out of here. Or maybe not. Maybe we're all clear. <laughs> okay. So our next quest is to just what? Return to uh oh, closing the vault. So when you bought the oh. And return to uh Hyor and ah. Lu, uh, or however you say her name, I forget. I keep forgetting. Because it's <laughs> really, really weirdly spelled, and it probably doesn't sound like it's spelled. Is Viking? Yes, it is. All right, all right. What news do you bring? The firebrand's flame burns no longer. It was Jorvik's abbess, Inkiborg. Gods, I would never have suspected. Does the orders reach no no bounds? None, and it is often those we least expect who carry out their ambitions. The abbess sought to destroy all Christian texts in the city, rid Jorvik of their ideals. She did utter a phrase that perked my ears. One of the four is ours. Four? But there are only three targets in Jorvik. Could there be something we're missing? Damn Picts! Not only do they hold the North, but those lawless six have free roam in our lands as well. Yours said our spies are on the ground. Under the ground. Only one of them has returned, bone-beaten and bloodied. The Howling Mother takes them. Lovina, a moment of your time, and Hyor if he's about. I will be with you shortly. A valuable seal. And a riddle. One of the four is ours. One of the four. Rysie, Faravid, Odin, and... Hjor. The four members of the Council. We should search their offices now, while they're occupied with the Yuletide Feast. Yes. Yes. Come. To the archives. Could I have missed something? We will find out soon enough. Well, let's see. I'm pretty sure it's the king. He really gives me that secret hidden Templar vibe. The room to the left. That is where the councilmen confer. A list. What Jorvik needs for the Yuletide feast. That is Aldon's handwriting. Items have been struck out. Where did he find the funds to make this larger purchase? Aldon is a well-connected man. I see. I have seen these. Weapons and supplies. Enough for a small group of fighters. Hardly enough for Haftan's army. Could be why Feravid is pressing the council for more silver. A wax seal, similar to the one I found in the sewers. 
the seal you took from the needle's hand. You don't think someone could have stolen it? Let's keep searching. It's possible. This desk, it looks as though it's been moved here. That's yours, desk. It is loaded with silver. Okay, to be delivered to Coppergate Market, I will need this smelted down, and I will uh, procure more uh, if necessary. Bre breathe not a word. Oh, God, it's here? Scratch marks on the floor. Your desk used to be against the other wall. So why the change? A hidden entrance. Where does this lead? Got the door. Right, let's see. Get down. Huh. There was wine here. Whoever moved it did so in a hurry. A load of wine was removed from here, and the room smells of almonds. It may be the wine was poisoned. It is likely the wine for the Yuletide feast. Do you think one of the council means to kill someone? Looks that way. It is not him, not Mayor. He would never do this. He... Keep your focus. Once we have all the facts, then we can worry about Hjor. Right now we need to get to the Yuletide feast. The people are in danger. You're right. The Roman Amphitheater. Let us go. Okay, let's move. Oh, oh she's just taking a weird out. path. Do you see the wine? No. Then there's still time. The entire council is here. Any one of them could be the vault. I need you to keep an eye out for the wine. I'll speak to each of the council members, see if I can trap them in a lie. Even your? Even your. If he is the vault, I'll not allow him to kill all these people. Juvena. I heard you. Just grant me one thing. Confer with me before you make your move. I will. Alright, time to go on hunting. Speak to Luvina before we uh, do anything. Suspects are part of the Yorvik Council. Now, to speak to the council members. I'll speak of the wine and watch for their reactions. That may lead me to the vault. Hello, sir. Faravit, a word if I may. Ah, Drenger. If it's to join arms with me, the answer is yes. We can use someone like you against the Picts. I may be courted, but I am selective with whom I join. Are you a drinker? Ha! <laughs> if that is a challenge, I am up for it. Very well. <laughs> I'll return with some wine. Wine? <laughs> Come now, we will do this over ale. That will give us a good measure of who can better fight its lure. All right. Didn't seem too worried. <laughs> Plus, he's, what he's a, a Viking, so you know. Alden has ale done is all they drink. He has indeed. The High Reeve of Jorvik has a bright future ahead if he keeps this up. Udon? Aldon, it seems you have found the Aldun. funds to go ahead with the feast after all. You must be elated. <laughs> that is putting it lightly. Look at it! I could not have asked for a better turnout. Soon the feast will begin. And these people will be given everything they deserve. We should honor you. I'll fetch you some wine. Uh, no, no, no. I, I mustn't indulge. Uh, the wine is for the people of Jorvik. Uh, but when it arrives, do help yourself. 
He has indeed. That was suspicious as fuck. Has a bright future ahead if it keeps this up. Very suspicious. Where is the Right, so Sure. How are you, my friend? They haven't had much time to talk since she's got there. Sure. Who is that? There you are. I was beginning to worry. Worry not. We have tracked the vault here. He's someone on the council. You are certain? I am. Once I discover who, I will dig my blade into his heart and end this for good. Until then. It's important that I investigate without raising suspicion. I need your help. Of course. What do you need me to do? Drink yourself into a drunken fit. What? Why? I need a distraction. Keep their eyes off of me. The wine should arrive soon. Drink three full cups, then make a scene. I can't be seen doing that. You'll have to find another way. Just do it. Okay. I will have the silver ready in the coming days. Thank you, Bob. Of course. So Hewer has just been counterfeiting coin to, you know, basically just create silver. Rishia. Ah, come to join the feast, have you? I have some bad news. The wine for the feast has spoiled. Of course it has. Why would I expect differently? I'll have my men dump it. There may be more wine in my private stores. I'll send a man to retrieve it. Is there anything else? That is all. Enjoy the feast. I shall try. Wow, I think that's the most, like, non-malicious, non, um, non, just evil sounding thing he's said in his tongue. Eivor, have you uncovered who the vault is? I believe I have. Each of the council members has given me reason to suspect them. Some more than others. Who is it you suspect? I suspect Aldun was the one pushing for the feast from the start. He planned it, which means he would have had access to the wine. And he was helping Abbas Inkiborg collect Christian texts. She turned out to be the firebrand. Yes. Yes, you're right. And the wine? Of all the councilmen, he knew the wine had not yet arrived. When I offered some, he flat out refused, insisting it be saved for the guests. For these reasons, I think Aldun is the vault. Brothers, sisters, dear friends, welcome all. Before we begin, I would like to introduce our honored guests. Here with me are some of Jorvik's most revered lords, men and women who have kept Jorvik trudging through these harsh times. I am pleased to say that today, on today, we honor you. We honor as well the nobles to whom we are all so The wine. Indebted. Aldun is the vault. So like for them, we must not miss our chance. Join me now in celebrating their successes and yours. To everything you deserve and to more. Shit. And now... Deafened and blinded by lust for indulgence, your foolish pride. I will tell you just what nobility is. A death sentence. A new world of order is upon us. A pity none of you will live to see it. Get the councilmen to safety. I will handle Aldun. Go. Alright, that's the most Templar thing that's ever happened in this game. Since they stopped being Templars. There is no escape. No future for people like this. Where are you go are you really running in circles? Break you! You're mine! Mine! No escape, you troll hogs bear! I'm sorry, call of it! There we go. Oh jeez!
血，这。Of course that missed. I missed him and he climbs up. Time to fight. How much longer? Where is he? Dead. He, he's dead. That's where he is. Okay. What did you hope to gain with all this? What riches are worth so much misery and the deaths of honorable men and women? Only a feeble mind would call them honorable. They are privileged, sedentary, complacent. They wasted their resources. I secured our power through wealth. I contributed to the future of a glorious order. On the backs of honest people, merchants and priests and nobles alike. A4, you are wrong. Held back by your primitive cosmology. Nine worlds in the tree? No. Nine times nine thousand worlds. And as many sons. Nine nights I hung in the tree, sacrificing myself to myself. So does the wise one seek wisdom. Countless spheres awaiting our gift, our enlightenment. I live in one world only. You live in none. Your Lufina, where did they go? God, Eivor is a badass. I love her so much. <laughs> Alright, we're clear. He's still alive? Ugasa! He's alive, Ugasa! just unconscious. Alright, um... Let's go find the others. Actually, it said I got a bunch of order clues. Was it just for those? Yeah. Oh, wow. We have done quite a bit. Somewhere in Essex for the sickle. Which way? This. Really? Okay. Let's go regroup again. Be my eyes soon. Davor, over here. Are you all right? We're fine. Faravud and his cars escorted King Rishier back to the royal hall. Everyone is Let's safe. Let's regroup there. Okay. Go on back. <laughs> that has to be a traumatizing shit show for real. Well, the vault is dead, so here's hoping we don't, uh, don't need to, uh, you know. Worry about another attack. Alden, that sniveling little shit. Conspiring right under our noses. I'll kill him! 
I don't care. I want answers. Calm, Lord Rishie. Aldon is dead. That doesn't calm me. I wanted to rip the bastard's spine out myself. You want to calm me? Start talking. Aldun aligned himself to a secret group that was plotting to overtake Jorvik. He had help from two others. Grigory the Dark Master and Ingeborg the Abyss. And you, Eivor? You were after these conspirators from the moment you arrived? Yes, though I could not let it be known. This group can reach any person, permeate the walls of any city. Much like the worms of a spoiled apple. They would have eaten Jorvik from the inside out if we let them. But you stopped that from happening. We owe you a debt of gratitude. You can be sure half the Jarl will hear of this. If the threat is gone, then you have my gratitude as well. I'm alive today. And so are many others because of you. I'd like to name you an honorary High Reeve of Jorvik, Eivor. Would you accept? It has a nice sound to it. You honor me, Lord. You have earned it. Then if I may, a hoard of silver is left unaccounted for in the grottoes beneath these streets. That's right. Silver the Dockmaster was collecting. What do you propose we do with it? Give it to the merchants or fund Halfdan's war. Hard-working merchants were robbed of their wares. Honor Yuletide by giving the silver back to the honest citizens of Jorvik. A wise suggestion. I agree. Fine. I will see to it that Hjord distributes the silver evenly. Come, Faravid. Help me secure this hoard. I could use a bloody walk. We have a saying in Bjarnia. Only the dead get to complain. And we're still living. I could muster a few complaints about the king and the treasury. But I shall forbear. You did it, Eivor. We did. It may be we were the recipe to keep Norway from Harald all along. We still can be. No. Norway is behind me now. And the rest of England ahead. That said, I must be going. Wait. Should you ever need us, we will come. One last thing. The silver on your desk, Yor. It planted a seed of doubt in my mind, so I must know. What is it for? I suppose I can forgo the element of surprise. I hired a silversmith to craft a love token for Lufina. A Yuletide gift. You sneak. I'll take my leave before you shame the throne. <laughs> Until our paths cross again, old friend. In this world, or the next. If you drop by Jorvik again, please join us for an aim. I know of a place down the street. Alright. Is that the end of it then? Yes, it is. Seems the wind calls me back to Randy. Best tell her the good news. All right, let's go uh, tell Ranvi of the good news. And, and where's Ravensthorpe? Down here. And we'll see how she handles it. No doubt she'll be happy. All right, let's, uh, let's head on back. Hello, doggo. Can I pet you? No? Okay. Eivor! Tak für Sidast! Hey, kids! I have no clue how many medallions I have to give to, uh... Hytham. But I, I think I've got enough. We'll, we'll see after we talk to Renby. Eivor? I have purged the Order of Ancients from Jorvik with Juvina and Jord's aid. And should we ever need theirs, they will come. You do this work well, Eivor. Is it a prelude to you joining the Hidden Ones? I doubt it. 
Not enough glory in these back alley brawls. <laughs> You're right. I feel you. Okay. Let's. Oh, two letters. A bow. Oh, the bow from uh, that the Alderman of Essex gave. Hytham's letter. If I received another letter from your our poor fellow soldier of Christ, he may be he, uh, uh, he may have uncovered a few more new targets. Uh, visit my bureau when you have the time, Hytham. I should talk to Hytham about my next targets. More intel. Uh, let's check the inventory for a second. Superior hunter bow, flawless hunter bow. Hmm. Let's see about upgrading this. We'll go down to uh, Gunnar. Let me see. Uh... I should talk to Hytham. Yep, we're gonna talk to him in a second. See what he's got for us. But first. Upgrades. Upgrades, people. May I see your stores? Is that what you want? Right. In Already off the guards. Nothing else I can do for you? Nope. See you later, Gunnar. I must take my leave. So long. Be well, my friend. Oh, before I talk to him, I want to upgrade, um... Because I got some supplies, so I can upgrade some other stuff. Ninety supplies for that. Now let's talk to Hythe. <laughs> Greetings, brother. Jorvik is now free of the Order's influence. Brilliant as ever, my friend. Thank you for all you have done. Ah, here is something for you. An odd letter arrived a few days ago, signed by one calling himself... A poor fellow soldier of Christ. That's right. Someone you know. Not by sight. But this soldier has intimate knowledge of the Order. He's the reason I have found them so easily in the cities. The letter says you must travel to Winchester, visit God's house and look for a man in white. Then recite this passage. When pride cometh, then cometh shame. But with the lowly... Cometh wisdom. All right. I'll speak with Ranvi. Get a fuller picture of all this. Do you need something? Uh. Okay, can't give you any medallions. I That's have fine. to go. Then go in peace. Okay, Winchester. Jesus. I thought that would be more of an endgame sort of thing, because uh, Winchester is the capital of Wessex. Oof. Okay, but I thank you so much, ladies and gentlemen, citizens of the Empire, for joining me. If you enjoyed and you, uh,. And you haven't already, please like, comment, subscribe, all that goodness. Uh, if you're watching on YouTube, on Twitch, drop me a follow if you haven't already. And I will see you all next time.